see why 5-pad is clearly broken. One of its two triggers is not working anymore. After removing the pad, we figured out the connector is loose. We removed all screws to disassemble the rubber cover. There are still two screws left which keep the board in place. Another evidence for the broken jack is the crack in the yellow clue. The little flat cable needed to be disconnected. We opened the grey lock and pulled out the cable. And there is our problem. A broken solder joint. Fortunately for us the electric board is not damaged and we could easily re-solder the part. After fixing the board, we screwed everything together and filled the crack with super glue. We attached the rubber cover and tightened the screws really carefully to not compress the rubber. We mounted the pad and connected the cable. Time for the first test. As you can hear, the trigger works again and the pad is fully functional again. Thanks for watching! Give us a like and check out our other videos.